Hey guys, how's it going? I got some slugs today and I finally uh, made it out here. Uh, I brought with me my uh, TC Pro Hunter 12 gauge with a uh, 26 inch rifled barrel and a illuminated uh, vortex crossfire scope that I just removed uh, the diamond back vortex and put the illuminated scope on. I have a uh, 1187 20 gauge with a uh, Hollison uh, 507C. It's nice, uh, but I'm not overly impressed with it. Then I have a uh, Mossberg 930 with a uh, 24 inch uh, smooth bore Carlson's choke tube and a uh, Vision King uh, scope. And then on my uh, Mossberg SA20 tactical, it has a illuminated primary arms one by four. This is their uh, inexpensive uh, $129 optic. Uh, the glass looks great, uh, but it's kind of tough on the eye relief. Uh, we'll see how that does. That uh, Mossberg SA20 has no choke. It's a uh, full choke on the tactical barrel, but it's awesome with Winchester slugs. And uh, I brought out with me a uh, Magnum Research uh, 22 Magnum uh, light with a uh, Hilux uh, optic on it. So we're gonna shoot some slugs at 100 yards. Uh, the only rifled barrel is the uh, TC Pro Hunter and uh, We'll see how we're going to do. For the TC Pro Hunter, I have some uh, Hornaday SSTs, but it loves rifled Winchester slugs, especially the deer season. Uh, I brought some Fiocchis, but uh, the Fiocchis have been uh, not stabilized at 100 yards, and they're... Uh, they're uh, making some pretty nice holes in there, but they're pretty accurate still. Then I got these uh, Hornaday Sabo slugs on sale. And uh, I'm going to try them. But uh, basically everything I have loves uh, Winchester slugs. So uh, the 20 gauge, we're just going to throw in uh, rifled Winchester slugs. So uh, let's see how we do.